12 facts to follow tonight. Uh, and Father, I, I have a uh, small confession. I have been practicing pronouncing your name, but I'm gonna give it a shot. I noticed that other people just say Father Vincent because they're, they're a little bit worried about pronouncing the last name. <laughs> Father Churchill. That was practiced while reading Delaney cards, teaching at the Utrecht High School close to a day. <laughs> I want to say, first of all, so I am Councilman Mark Trader. It is my honor to represent the communities of Gravesend, Bensonhurst, Coney Island, and Seagate. Not Sheep City. But we love Sheep City. Uh, I want to say, first of all, before I, I go into my remarks, I want to thank the outstanding uh, parish, Our Lady of Grace, and the dinner committee. Give everyone a round of applause that put work into making this beautiful dinner happen tonight. This work does not happen by itself. So thank you. I want to say that as someone who has been born and raised in Southern Brooklyn, Gravesend is a remarkable neighborhood. Gravesend is home to many hardworking families. It's home to veterans. It's home to senior citizens that even in the golden years of their lives, they're still so active in so many different parts of our community life. It's home to teachers, nurses, retired personnel from many important city services. It's home to very active, energetic youth that are involved in so many clubs and activities. It's just an amazing place. A place that honors and pays tribute to our veterans and our armed forces serving and our country and overseas, and we have to God, we have to support them every single day. Not just Memorial Day, not just Veterans Day, but every single day. It's home to a neighborhood that has love and support for the brave men and women of our New York City Police Department every day as well, and to our firefighters and all our first responders. It is really a remarkable place. But the question that has to be asked, what is the glue that ties this together? What ties this together? What inspires this energy and spirit and enthusiasm and this sense of service, this sense of giving to others, the sense of this is not just your child, this is our child. This is not just your grandma, this is our grandma. That place is our Lady of Grace. That is the glue that ties our neighborhood together. There's a saying, a community that prays together stays together. Well, if you want to check the pulse of Gravesend, you walk into our Lady of Grace parish. And Father Vincent Churchill. I'm going to say the full name. You set the tone. Leadership is about setting the tone. And so the sense of service, the sense of participation, not just on Sundays, and I'm sure that people are still being encouraged to attend that service, but if you think about Our Lady of Grace, they have activities for young people. We did a street renaming for Barbara, who worked with so many of our youth. We have activities for our seniors, the golden age, the widow support. We always honor and pay tribute to our Boy Scouts, our Eagle Scouts. Am I right about that? Yes. Our Eagle's race is a pillar 
in South Brooklyn. It is a pillar in our neighborhood. Gravesend in Southern Brooklyn would not be the place we are if it was not for all of embrace. And the example, Father Vincent Cherichella, that you set and that you continue to set for everyone. The sense of service, love, pride, faith, family, and after hearing the remarks of your brother, it's in your DNA. It's in your DNA. The sense of family, faith, community. And so we wish you over 120 years of great health, of family, faith, and community in continued service. God bless you and your entire family and the entire parish of Our Lady of Grace. We have, I have as well a very small token of appreciation that I'd like to present to you. I'll walk over to you. You're, you're, the, you're the man of the hour. This is a New York City proclamation from City Council paying tribute to the outstanding service to Graves and community and to all of New York City. God bless you and